Index signatures allow us to type objects with an unknown structure, but where we know the types of the keys and values. Let's say we have a ticketing application that allows users to book seats at a cinema. The seats are numbered A1 through 10 and goes further up the alphabet to G, also 1 through 10. The tickets themselves are numbered with some sort of unique number. So we know that the seat numbers should be strings, and the tickets should be numbers. We don't want to define individual properties, like B1 or G5. It's not only repetitive, but what if we add other cinemas later on that uses a different numbering system? This is where we can use index signatures to create properties dynamically. First we'll do square brackets, then give our dynamic property a name, like seat, and a type of string but we also need to specify what type the value will be. In our case, the tickets use numbers as their unique identifiers. So, we'll go outside the square brackets and set the type to number. Okay, now let's create an instance, so, let, seats, equal, new seat assign. Then we can do seat, b1 equals, the unique ticket number. And let's do another seats, d7, unique ticket number. So, with index signatures, we can create dynamic properties with type safety.